next we have Cameron. Hey coach, got a two part question here. Um, would you mind sharing the best thing you learned about your coaching staff or the, oh, and the players over the last uh, few months? And then well, – uh, Go ahead. Ask the second one. My, my second question would be, what would be your message to society on improving or even eradicating racial inequalities in this country? Well, I'll start with that. The, the, the first one is being more tolerant uh, and listening and, and understanding. I mean, we have a senator – uh, that, that tweets at Woj yesterday just because he was talking about what we're going to put on the back of our jersey. And they always try to turn it into the military or the police. Uh, there's no league that does more for the military than the NBA. Uh, but how about that senator? I'll make a challenge. We will do things for the troops as long as he acknowledges Black Lives Matter. I think that would be really cool for him to do. Uh, you know, it's funny. Whenever we talk about justice, people try to change the message, Colin Kaepernick kneels, uh, it had nothing to do with the troops. It had to do with social injustice and everyone tries to change the narrative. How about stand on what we're talking about and dealing with that instead of trying to trick us or change or trick your constituents? How about being real? Uh, I guarantee you, we've done more for, for the military than probably that senator. And I guarantee you this, we've also are going to do things for Black Lives Matter. How about him? Maybe he should join into that. And on the other thing, that's what I've learned is about of our players and our coaches who are just really involved. Uh, they are, um, uh, you know, obviously you learn about basketball and that's great. Uh, but through the COVID uh, and the times that we've done Zoom, I think what I've learned more is, is about our players as people uh, and what they stand for. Mm 